Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy MFTF Games with my first video of the new year. As the title suggests, I want to go over my thoughts of the current state of Fortnite creative, the good, the bad, and the ugly, but also where I hope to see it in the future. One of the good things that Fortnite creative definitely has going for it right now is definitely the variety. There is no shortage of variety in game modes such as OBs, you have tycoons, you have practice maps, etc, etc. And that's something from when for Fortnite creative first came out was not there. There was not a lot of variety. And now you see what it's grown into, which is pretty cool. It's kind of like Roblox, which is kind of like a good thing. And I've always compared Roblox to Fortnite once uh, Fortnite Creative came out. I honestly think that Fortnite, if it keeps going in the current direction that it is, has the potential to be an even better Roblox. Now Roblox has the advantage of not having you know, weapons and stuff like that. So it's kind of easier to manipulate. But for the most part, I really do think that Fortnite can be a better Roblox. Um, and I will stick by that statement. But variety definitely doesn't lack in Fortnite. The bad thing about that, the other side of that is, although it has variety for something that's labeled Fortnite creative, I don't see a lot of creativity. Now, what I mean by this is if you take a good look at, you know, a mode example like Gun Game, literally these maps are all the same. And same thing for the box fights, um, one good look, and this is literally all you see. Um, now I get why it's like that from the business perspective. I mean, why go ahead and spend all your time and hard work on a map that's just gonna instantly flop when you can create something that's quote unquote safe and still you know make a profit? I can kind of see that example, but at the same time as you know, as a consumer, it kind of sucks that this is literally all that we have to play is kind of these quote unquote recycled maps. And after a while, these recycled maps kind of get boring, especially when you play, you know, with your friends or family over and over again. I don't know if it's just me, but when Fortnite Creative 2.0 first came out, I had a lot of hope for the Fortnite Creative. And don't get me wrong, I still do. But kind of where we're going right now doesn't look too promising. Uh, the variety is there, but as, like I said, the creativity is definitely lacking. When they dropped the creative 2.0 maps, you know, the TDM style map that they released and, you know, the test map with the dragon, I honestly think like that was scratching the surface. And honestly, since then, I haven't really seen any map use those tools, use those mechanics. Like the only maps that come to my mind when I think definitely revolutionary was Fortnite Only Up. And even then, I think that was still using not even Fortnite Creative 2.0 uh, tools, but like you have Fortnite Only Up, you have Squid Games, you have, I think there was a, a survival game mode. I think it was called like kind of a ripoff of the Hunger Games. I think that was a cool Fortnite uh, creative map. But since then, I don't think anything Fortnite creative wise has really stuck out. And I really do think that's a problem, but I just wish it really wasn't like that. I wish there was more creativity inside the game modes, especially given the fact that we do have creative 2.0 tools now. I don't know. I just feel like we're really just one Fortnite map away from having like a big shift to Fortnite creative. I think Fortnite Battle Royale hasn't really been as popular as, you know, in the past. And I think Fortnite OG kind of proved that. I think we've kind of fallen off from the Battle Royale perspective since then. Um, no one's really talking about Battle Royale. And a lot of people are saying that Battle Royale isn't as good as it used to be. And I get that Fortnite is trying to push creative. I just don't feel like this is the way to do it. Having these same recycled maps, and please don't even get me started with these red versus blue type maps. I honestly think they're kind of plaguing the Fortnite search options. And I just don't really think they're all that enjoyable. Once you play one map, I honestly think you've played them all. Um, and it's just, it's just the same thing. It's just the same recycled maps. And hopefully one day we can kind of get a better Fortnite creative or someone can step up and make their own unique Fortnite creative maps. But yeah, thank you guys so much for listening to the rant. I know it was kind of all over the place, but I just kind of wanted to get it off my chest. Let me know if you guys agree with the current state of Fortnite creative. Do you see it going up? Do you see it going down? I'm curious on what your thoughts are. Thank you guys for listening. MFTF Games out.